And now for the tell of the tape in the blue corner from Ecuador. Fighting out of the Puma team, Francisco Ortiz is his coach. He's 23 years old, 1.74 meters tall, right-handed, five fights, five victories, four by knockout. Let's introduce Aaron Canarte. In the red corner from Sierra. He's fighting out of the Pitbull Brothers Club. Valjean Silva is his coach. He's 35 years old. 1.75 meters tall, right-handed. This is his first fight in the WGP. Let's introduce Ronnie Jason. Let's see how all of this, if this brutal MMA training has transferred over to WGP kickboxing. Aaron Kanach from Ecuador is a very good fighter. Let's see this light middleweight division. Who starts out with what? And we see the Ecuadorian starting out with a low kick, easily evaded by the veteran Ronnie Johnson. Ronnie Jason, sorry. We see Ronnie Jason with jujitsu written on his back. Certainly, probably, definitely a well rounded fighter. Let's hope he doesn't pull out any of that out of his hat tonight against young Aaron. Ronnie Jason is known for really pounding away at the body. He likes to go for hard body shots. Good right overhand by Ronnie, Ronnie Jason. And we see young Aaron Kanachi moving forward. Good boxing stance. Good jab from Ronnie Jason. Oh, and a good body shot there from Ronnie Jason. Leg kick from Aaron. Oh, and he knocks down Ronnie Jason with a good right hand. Great right hand right over top of Ronnie Jason's guard and catching him right in the face, knocking him down. And now he smiles and he comes back. Let's see. If he's going to come back with everything, if he was just unlucky, let's see what comes out of this. The last time we saw a UFC fighter in here was with a in the heavyweight division, a tall young guy from Paraguay, just about had his ribs broken in 10 places. Definitely a very experienced fighter in the MMA world. But like we said, Aaron Kanach is a good fighter. He's strong, he's very fast, and he's very young. He's got a lot of experience for his young age, and he's a very fast fighter. 20 seconds left in this first round. Ronnie Jason. Oh, and a good left and a good right combination from Ronnie Jason. Definitely not taking anything away from the younger fighter from Ecuador. He is not afraid. He is moving in. He's doing a great job. Fantastic job. He's actually probably ahead in this first round. Great job by both fighters. Be right back with the second round of this super, this light middleweight fight.
two. And we see a very fast Aaron Canarch coming out with those great hands of his. There's a good front kick from Ronnie Jason. Oh, and a good knee followed by a left jab. And a good body shot from Ronnie Jason. Another good body shot. There he goes. Now he's throwing some bombs in there. Little the experience you can see is waiting and waiting. Some great, those of everything he threw in that last exchange hurt young Aaron Kanarch. But he is still standing. He's come back. And he is here to fight as well. He is not afraid. He's not intimidated by this more experienced fighter. And Roddy Jason back into the corner now. Using more of a defensive strategy, counterattacking most of what's coming at him from Aaron. And not a whole lot happening. There goes a good roundhouse kick from Aaron Kanarch. Blocked by Jason, but still. Oh, and there goes a high roundhouse kick, but that was blocked as well. Good body shot from. Oh, and a good uppercut from Ronnie Jason. He's got a great jab after he lands from either a kick or from a knee. And he comes down, he's able to plant that jab right away. Oh, and a good right hand from Aaron Kanarch. Good left hand. Both fighters moving around. There goes a good knee from, a jumping knee from Aaron Kanarch. Didn't catch Ronnie Jason, but it was a good try. Oh, and a good right hand from Kanarch. Just dodged by Ronnie Jason. Jason moving around more in this second round. 13 seconds left in this second round of this three round scheduled fight. The young fighter from Ecuador moving around, doing a good job keeping his, holding his own. But you can definitely see the experience coming from Ronnie Jason. Be right back folks with round three of this light middleweight special fight. Round three, and there goes Ronnie Jason egging on the crowd, trying to get some action, some excitement into this ring, into this arena. And there they go, both of them starting off the good boxing, not doing a whole lot of kicks, either one of them. And Ronnie Jason still smiling through this. He seems pretty confident that he's going to win this fight. Very cautious, he's watching what he's doing. He's very, very careful, Ronnie Jason is. There goes a good roundhouse kick from Ronnie Jason as he sinks that in right underneath 
the young Aaron's gloves. Jab, good right hand. Good two left jabs by Ronnie Jason. Another one in close short rabbit punches. The young Aaron is gonna have to be careful with those punches. Oh, and there goes a good counter from Aaron. Every time I say something, the young guy comes back right after. There goes a good right hand from Aaron Kanach. Another smile from Ronnie Jason. Not sure why he's smiling when he gets hit. Oh, and there goes a good right hand from Ronnie Jason. Lots of experience in that ring. You can tell as he's sort of just picking and choosing as he hits the young fighter. Not a lot of movement. Really careful kicking. 55 seconds left in this third round. A young fighter from Ecuador doing a great job. He is the only one who has had a knockdown in this fight, knocking down Ronnie Jason in the first round. There was a high kick from Ronnie Jason catching the young fighter, but he just brushed it off, came back at him. And you can hear... Ronnie Jason's coach telling him to kick, kick. Good right overhand from Ronnie Jason. And we're coming to the end of this third final round of this light middleweight special fight. Oh, and there goes a good couple of right hands. Oh, and a good left, a good right hand, sorry, by the Ecuadorian Aaron. And a good respectful exchange at the end. Great fight. We'll be back in just a second with the judge's official decision. I think we know who's going to win that. Hard to take away from the experience. But let's see how strongly that knockdown favors in Aaron's corner. We'll be right back, folks, with the judge's official decision. round will be the winner Ronnie. Ronnie Jason is the winner by unanimous decision